ਆਓ ਫਿਰ Hey guys, so since this is a season of good tidings, it's actually our favourite season. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Make sure you download our Christmas EP called Christmas, Christmas With you. you. Every year we release Christmas songs and we think that this particular EP, you'll love it. It's got soulful songs, it's got Afrobeat kind of infused songs, but it's all talking about the festive time of Christmas. Listen, even if you don't say about Christmas, you're going to love this album. It makes you feel good. Download it please guys. You're gonna love it anyway. So. so it's available on all streaming platforms, Spotify, iTunes, anywhere you can think of. Download it, stream our videos, watch our videos on YouTube. It's called Christmas of You. You see it somewhere. <laughs> Link down below. Hey, 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 whatever. Download it and support your girls. Thank you. Bye. So we're gonna talk about the wonderful Letitia Wright. It's Letitia Wright. Yeah. yeah. Um, so we all know that she is the Black Panther. And um, yeah, so I think even before, if I would say before, I would say that maybe directly after when they started doing the um, premieres, mm. it started bubbling on TikTok that she's got like, she's becoming like a bit of a, a gay, lesbian, like, icon. lesbian icon. Mm. But the minute the film came out, it's like it just exploded. Yeah, it's like all you these know? like edits of her, like, it's, it's, it was just random. Yeah, it's like, it's like, it's like they, 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 the edits, they make every, any little thing she does, they try, they make it some kind of homo or lesbo erotica mm. or something. Like she could literally just be reaching for a pen mm. <laughs> and they'll edit it in some way and to yeah. make it sexual. Yeah. Y'all create. I saw everything. I saw everything. Um. Anyway. <laughs> Why have you become a sex symbol? Why is my Twitter going nuts with hashtags about people wanting to take you out for a date? Listen, I'm just being myself. Um. You know, I, I, it's really flattering. I can't stop smiling at all the tweets and the TikToks and my hat. My name is a hashtag at like 500 million views. It yeah, yeah. Yeah, so so I I think she actually um she created a TikTok account because of all of the edits that go viral and stuff and um I think she she kind of referenced it. Mm. She didn't come out and say it, but she but she, but she I, I think there's something that they were saying they, they've got something where they say a, a vibranium really Oh, vibranium something. What is it? What's it <laughs> called? It? But it's basically vibranium oh. strap. Vibranium oh. strap. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, what kind of yeah. Thing is that? Oh, you see all the studs, all the not studs, but all the lesbians in it. Talking about vibranium straps. And they call themselves, what was it, the Letitia Wright Wives Club or something? Letitia Wright <laughs> Wives Association or something like that. Oh my yeah. gosh. As we prepare for the first official LWA meeting. Oh my god. I would just like to get a few things clear. One. We don't care about her sexual orientation, baby. We can look as much as we want to. Don't stop our fun, baby. You're just over here hating. Two, I have watched black movies since I was a kid growing up. And I have never, never seen a human being shut down the internet like this one is shutting down the internet. I need y'all to step back from Daddy Panther and let her have her shine. So I'm gonna need y'all to sit back and just let us appreciate how we are appreciating her. It may not come the way that you like it. But baby, we, we ain't here for you. This ain't for you. Oh, I love this game. <laughs> This is the LWA. Three. She don't mind. She done already told us she don't mind. So we gonna play. I'm not here to spoil you, it's lots of fun. I do think 
initially it started off as a bit of a joke, but I think people, it, like, it's actually quite a serious thing now. So obviously it's been a bit of a bit of banter because people are basically saying how, you know, they don't think that she's a lesbian because she she's, a, she's quite a staunch Christian. So there's a couple of things. So obviously people are kind of using her past work. So before Pop, Top Boy, she was in a couple of BBC programs and- She was in, a Top Boy? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's when she got a big break, yeah. So before Top Boy, she was in a couple of BBC programmes and one of these programmes, she was actually playing a lesbian. Mm -hmm. She was actually playing a, a girl that had an infatuation with, um, I don't know if it's a teacher or something. Oh, okay, yeah. 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 An older, older, a white, an older white lady, yeah. yeah. So, so she, oh, she clearly has played, you know, that kind of character before and then I'm not sure what her character was like in Top Boy, but then obviously now she's in, now she went to um, Black She wasn't Panther. a lesbian in Top Boy. Yeah. She was so, quite... Masculine, mm. a little bit. Yeah, so I do think obviously the short hair, you know, and 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 the fact that she she doesn't dress that feminine, like her dressing is quite, you know, <laughs> we're doing that in it. Mm. Oh, <laughs> her, her dressing, her dressing can be quite tomboyish. So I do think with that, people have now are now running with it. Um, and then that when it was at its height, there was a video of her in a club. In a, in a gay, I think I think it was actually a gay club. Okay, it was heaven. Um, was it was it a gay club? I think it was heaven. Yeah. Yeah, you sure. Was, I, think. I think it was. I, I know Kalani was there, and that other rapper, that that um, Drea, Drea was there. It was it was lo loads of loads of um, out mm. artists, you know, artists that are you know, heavily in the, into the gay scene, you know. And Letitia was there, and the video that was trending was Kalani basically whining on um, Letitia. So obviously that you know got all the all the Letitia's wives club up in a frenzy. Mm. Look, see, 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 you know, it was almost like... Well, you know, they were saying that Kalani needs to stay away. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, they, want them, they want her for themselves. Yeah. <laughs> Look who I am. Back in high school, I used to... Yeah. Now I hit the FBO with duffels in my hands. I did have a Zan. Oh, 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 Video, I think there was, I think One she, yeah, she, I don't know if it was a video, but I know she was posting pictures of Eva, because mm -hmm. her and Eva are, are, are quite good friends. Mm -hmm. Eva is, 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 a, is a British model. So I think people were basically saying, oh, they're dating. So I think Eva basically commented and said, oh, now people think I'm gay or something mm -hmm. like that. And then the Kalani thing happened. So, 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 what do you think? Do you think? Do you think? Um, this show is gay. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I mean, to be honest, I, I basically was saying it how I've, I've, I think I've always said this to you guys that I think that she's bisexual. I have always said it. Mm. Um, but that could just be my internal, internal bias because she's got short hair, like, yeah. I, and she dresses tomboy. Like, mm. I don't know. I mean, for years I used to dress like a tomboy myself, and people mm. used to think I was a lesbian. So mm. I, I don't know. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Mm. Like, so it doesn't necessarily mean you're a lesbian. So mm. I, think that, I think that's just conditioning in my in yeah, my head. Yeah. yeah. I'm I'm of the similar uh, view to shape. Mm. I, I I don't know. It's a, it's a weird one. Like I, I feel like she might be uh, bi, mm. but oh, I don't know. It's just I don't think she is. Don't you? Nah. I don't think she, I, I just I just think that she's she's very just comfortable. Yeah, comfortable, she, she's just yeah. comfortable in 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 you know in expressing her masculine side or whatever you call it. Do you know what I mean? And I think that yeah, I just think that she's got a different way of expressing her femininity, mm. and that's what I think it is. Yeah, I just think, yeah, I agree. I mean, I'll be honest with you. Nine times out of ten, if I could wear a tracksuit anywhere, I would. Yeah. So. Yeah. Or just fling on some leggings with a baggy jumper. Like if I could, I really would. I'll be honest with you. And I also think as well with Letitia, like with her body shape and everything, I think she's very. She's got a very adrenaline look. Mm -hmm. So I think that that probably plays into it. Like I think if she was that really, if she had a really really curvy, curvy body, like yeah. like um um what's that other Lupita? Mm. She had like a you know what I mean if she was curvy like Lupita, people, even if she was a to tomboy, people probably wouldn't mm. necessarily see that. But because. Do you know what I mean? But because that's what I'm she's saying. quite slim. It plays into our thoughts on what femininity is. Yeah. Is what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's that bias that we have. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, guys, let us know what you think. Are you part of her wives association? <laughs> you know, let, let, let us know what you think. I, I, I know we have, you know, quite a lot of lesbians that follow us. So It's not only lesbians that are, that are part of the association. Yeah. Even straight women are part of it. Oh, I really? just think because she's such a, um, like, there's something about her 
Mm. I don't know what it is, but I feel like she's got such a, a lovely, a lovely aura yeah. about her. Her energy. Mm. Even watching her on, um, what do you call it? Black on Black Panther. Panther. Like, she's so captivating mm. watching. Yeah. Like, I don't know. She's just a beautiful person. She yeah. just comes across, in interviews, she comes across beautiful. Like, I, yeah, whatever. She's yeah. still killing it. She's mm. killing the game, and I'm, yeah. I'm here for it. Yeah, yeah, I don't I, look. I, it doesn't. Her sexuality does not bother yeah. me. I don't actually care. Yeah. yeah, we just thought it was a fun story to talk about. <laughs> it's because it's just funny when you watch TikToks. You know what I mean? It'll be interesting. Yeah. I'm, I'm actually excited to see like who she dates next. Like, mm. like, I, like I think that'll be really because I know before people were making rumors about her and John Boyega, but I think oh. I think it's because they went to I think they went to the same school and. Mm. They, they look, come from like the same clique yeah yeah so um so yes yeah, so it'll be interesting to see who she dates next man or woman you know let's see we're just proud of her exactly She's done so well. exactly I'm so proud of her exactly so. let us know what you think guys if you like this video give us a thumbs up comment and subscribe and hit the notification button because if you miss it you, you miss, miss it, it. Toodles. On a Christmas day.